Have you ever stopped for a while and think, what is our world made of? Or look at the mirror and think, what am I made of? Meet Adam, the building block of everything in the universe. And by everything, we mean all things, including yourself. Look at your hands. It contains trillions of atoms. Now pick out your hair. Your hair is about as thick as 500,000 carbon atoms stacked over each other. It's difficult to understand at first, but atoms are ridiculously small. Even the biggest atom is so tiny that we can only see them with a very special microscope called electron microscope. So who found out first about the atom? To find out, we need to travel back to the ancient Greece. In 5th century BC lived a man named Democritus, whom many historians believed had first proposed the idea of an atom. Back in his days, it was believed that if you were to chop up a matter, say a piece of apple, you could just chop it forever. There's no end. Democritus didn't think this was the case. Instead, he insisted that at some point, you will get something so small that it couldn't be divided anymore. This is what he called atomos or atoms, meaning uncuttable. Let's imagine a cookie. A cookie could be made of a collection of different types of ingredients, but these ingredients are basically molecules, which is made up of a group of different types of atom. Now look at your hands again. In biology, you may have learned that your body is made up of cells. Well, cells are made up of more complex molecules. And yes, these molecules are made of atoms. Anyway, now we know that everything is made up of atom, but how does it look like? What are these little balls? Don't worry, we got it all covered for you. To find out more about the structure of the atom, open Assembler app and go to Learn with Assembler Profile. You will find a 3D model of an atom complete with description of each of its parts. So that's our story for today. Time to surprise your teachers and see you on our next videos.